Good morning, good happy Monday morning. So welcome to this new show, which is the Get Unstuck show. So today you've got me, Sarah. Normally you'll have me and Hannah from the Holistic Health Collective. And this show is uh, your weekly dose of motivation and structure, as well as practical tips to help you move forward with your week. So this is for you if you're health conscious, busy working woman looking for natural sol solutions to your health. So you're gonna be using things like menus. So I'm gonna be going through my smoothie bowl this morning. Um, motivational quotes, mindset, movement. We're gonna be looking at the moon phase, so lots of M's here, you can see a theme. Um, to help you kind of elevate your energy, upgrade your mindset, for finding calm against the chaos of modern day living <laughs> and practical rituals that are gonna help you to light up your soul. So today I just wanted to let you know moon phase wise. So we use <clears throat> the moon as a calendar. So it's a 28 day uh, cycle, 28 and a half, 29 day cycle. And we look at using different points in the cycle to help us point to what we should be doing, how we should be outputting our energy. And if you look at it very simply, from a new moon to a full moon phase, which takes two weeks, this is where we should be putting more energy output into projects, moving forwards. And when we hit the waning phase, which is from the full moon back to the new moon, this is where we can look at reviewing, reflecting and receiving as well. So today we had the full moon at the weekend on Friday and now we're in the waning phase. It's known as a wax, uh, waning gibbous. So waning means energy lowering and gibbous means full. So it still looks very full at the moment. It uh, looks like it's bulging still. And this phase is really about receiving. So any hard work that you've put out there, you might be receiving the fruits of your labor now. And our motivational quote that we're looking at today is actually from Maya Angelou. And actually, I'm just gonna remind myself what it is. I love her and uh, I love her quote. So she says, if you don't like something, change it. And if you can't change it, change your perspective. And that's, I find that a really empowering quote because it kind of puts you in the driving seat. Yes, we can't change everything and we certainly can't have control over everything, but we can change our perspective on things. And that does take a little bit of motivation and mindset work. So come and join us each week and we'll help you move forwards with that. But today we wanted to go into my smoothie bowl, which is here. So tell me if you're into your smoothies and if you've ever had them in a smoothie bowl. So this is something that I've been having every morning throughout the summer, and it really helps you to elevate your energy. It's very much eating in line with the seasons and helping you to maximize your day so that you don't get those energy slumps and that you're eating very live food, very packed with vitamins and minerals and high energy so that you can move through your day comfortably and you've got the um, energy to do that what you want. You can put the effort into the things that light you up. So um, I'm gonna just post the recipe for this, but the base is of a frozen fruit, and this is mixed berries, so anything that's seasonal, and you can buy this in the supermarket, just in the frozen fruit section. I've got a local farm shop that I um, go to, and there's a few grapes in there as well. And then you wanna add a green food, really. So for me this morning, I put a little bit of avocado and some courgette in there. Now you don't have to put that many things in, I just had these in the fridge and wanted to use them up, because I'm going away in a few days' time, so I'm making the most of what's in there. So you wanna get some kind of green food, and that might be spinach, it might be um, spirulina, anything that's green because that's going to really oxygenate the body and help to remove heavy metals which can be quite um, full of toxins. So I've blended that up with a coconut milk. You might like to use an oat milk or a hemp seed milk, something like that. Any f um, plant based milk. We don't want to be um, using dairy because dairy can be uh, very, it can inflame the body. Um, and then I've added um, cacao powder. So cacao is a form of chocolate, which is really rich in magnesium. So very good for the muscles of the body. It's got iron in there, which is great for us ladies as well. So I've blended that all up together and then I've added some chia seeds. So if you've never tried a chia seed, it's, um, 
it's a tiny little seed which is super packed full of energy and it swells up once you put liquid with it it's really got a lot of essential fats in there and essential fats are great for your brain health so if you need to put a lot of mental output today then your chia seeds are a good go-to and then i've just uh, blended it all up popped it in the bowl and then i've added some bees pollen which is this uh, beautiful yellow ingredient and that's very good if you suffer from allergies especially hay fever and then i've just added some cacao nibs as well just for a little bit of crunch and again like the cacao powder there's a little bit more essential fats in these so like i said very good essential fats you need for every cell of your body every function in the body and that will be what I have now um, until lunchtime. So I like to do intermittent fasting, which we spoke about on our last video. Um, and that you should, if you try that way of eating for a, for a while, and it, summer is a really good time to do that because naturally, hopefully, we should be feeling a little bit more energized because there's more light around. The winter is quite a hard time to fast, um, or maybe it isn't for you, but it can, can be more um, tiring to do it that way. Um, so yes, thank you for joining us for the first session. We'll be here next week at half past eight with the next uh, uh, Get Unstuck show. See you then.